Tonight, we have new information into the robbery of a Muldrow convenience store. Police have released the name of the man who they say wrestled a cash drawer out of an employee's hands. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker shows us video as it happens and video as police chase the suspect across state lines. Just caught me off guard. I've worked here for 10 years and I've never had any kind of issues like this happen. Best store employee Joanne Simpson says it was around 5 a.m. when a man walked into her store on East Chantel Smith Boulevard. Mulder police say they believe the man in the video is 48-year-old Jeremiah Williams Tubbs. Simpson says the man asked her how much a sucker and gum cost. She then walked over to the cash register to check him out. I said I was checking him out. He reached over the counter to try to take money and drag my drawer and I jerked the drawer away from his hand. He started to go outside the store, so Simpson thought he was leaving, but he wasn't set my drawer down to reach under my counter to get our gun and he come back in and jerked the drawer and took off. The clerk was able to see that the man drove off in a white minivan and not long after that, Roland police officers spotted that white minivan driving east on I-40 and that's when the pursuit started. Here you see Roland officers standing behind a patrol car after the suspect pulled over, asking him to get out of the car. Then he drives off and the pursuit continues to Van Buren where their police take over. He crashed the minivan near North 6th Street in Fort Smith, injuring someone in a vehicle he hit. Muldrow Police Sergeant Mark Harkin says the owner of the minivan is not the man who was driving it, and they got permission to search the vehicle from its owner. In it, they found clothing the man was seen wearing in the robbery surveillance video and some of the stolen cash. For this area, um, it's not something we see a lot. Typical of the season, I would say. Um, you know, we've got some holidays. You know, just it really gets people stressed out and, and they they just do things that they wouldn't typically or normally do. In Muldrow, covering news where you live, Katherine Gilker, 5 News. Police ask that if you have any information about Tubbs' whereabouts, you, to give them a call.